Welcome to Veronica's Wing. We are going to be sharing very, very briefly about my latest book, Guilty of Being Born Black. But what we really want to dig into on this episode is my trips to the Library of Heaven. We want to share some of the things we saw and heard. And so get ready. Buckle up. But I'm excited about what God is doing. And Cindy is along with us for the ride. Hey, Cindy, man. give him a shout out. <laughs> Hello, everybody. Glad to be here one more time. It's always a joy and a pleasure to be here with Prophet B. And uh, on our journey and on these adventures. And I wouldn't miss them for the world. And uh, so we're in for an exciting night tonight. So come on in and enjoy and yes. join us yes. as we go on this uh, adventure tonight mm-hmm. or today right. and, uh, and enjoy it. And yes. uh, just praying that, that God illuminates some things in our hearts and in our minds today uh, through this. Yes, yes. Amen. Amen. And also we're going to be talking about uh, just for a few minutes, two or three minutes, we want to just uh, let you know the how and the why of this book, of my latest mm-hmm. book, Guilty of Being Born Black. Mm-hmm. And we're going to be talking about a book entitled The Library of Heaven. And mm-hmm. these are experiences and encounters that we had with the Lord, and we'll share more about that when we get ready to go into it. But this particular book here, I'm excited about. And somebody might say, well, why would you write a book guilty of being born black? I'll tell you what happened. I was sitting in front of the television and I was looking at a YouTube video. And on the video, they were showing, you know, different things that are captured all around the world Mm -hmm. and different things. So there was a robbery, they said, that was going on at a shopping mall. So they called the uh, authorities, called the police. And the police, they showed the car zooming into the lot. Well, they zoomed into the lot and there was a black elderly couple standing up there by some stores. Hmm. They did not ask this or that, but they immediately went to that black elderly couple and got out and it was like they had judged them already. And Hmm. so they began to talk to the man and his wife pulled out her cell phone and began to um, film, video. And so uh, as she videoed, one of the cops looked and he went over to her and he said something to her. And uh, so uh, I guess he wanted her to stop filming or what have you, but she continued to film. And the next thing I knew, he had took this lady and slammed her down to the cement, slammed her down in such a way I could not believe it. And later, after I would think about it, I asked the Lord, I said, where did all that rage come from? Where did all that brutality come Mm -hmm. from? Where did all that evil come from? Where where did that anger come from? That he was literally, I mean, this lady was um, um, a senior. I mean, she was uh, up past where we are in age and everything, you know, and he slammed her down. Oh, my God. It was brutal. And that thing just kind of stayed with me. And off and on, my heart would just get sad when I think yeah. about that. You know, how could somebody do that? And so then I began to get a sense that God wanted some poetry written. And um, so I was thinking, I said, oh, it would be good to capture some of these things that are going on in society or what have you. Mm-hmm. And the thought came to my mind, and I know it was from the Lord, guilty of being born black. Guilty of being born black. And the Holy Spirit would just give me uh, words. They begin to flow again like a river. Yeah. In the past, when God would give me poetry, it would just flow. It would just flow mm-hmm. like a river. And uh, so I began to write down what he gave me. And this is about voices from the past. What's your experience, your encounter? You know, you uh, may be an individual and you may not even be of the black race, but what have you seen? What have you witnessed that broke your heart? Or mm-hmm. uh, you may be guilty of being born black and you had a numerous of experiences mm. about uh such encounters or you were judged and you would try up Ooh. front because of the color of your skin so 
this book um, God has a purpose for. So I'm excited as mm-hmm. we venture on and see how God will unfold this book into society, unfold. And uh, so we're excited. So perhaps we'll share more of uh, what's written within the pages at some point in time. Amen. All right. All Amen. right. Mm-hmm. But here we are. And Cindy, share how you first came to know about this book. <laughs> share what happened. Oh, um, uh, what has it been about two years ago now? Mm-hmm. Over, over two uh, years now. But, yep. Mm-hmm. Uh, Prophet B's husband was in serious critical uh, condition at the hospital. And um, when we first found out, or when I first found out, um, you know, he was in ICU. And the doctors were saying all kinds of things, how bad it was, what they were going to have to do, and it wasn't looking good, and all of those, just a lot of negative reports. And um, so, um, you know, we're thinking uh, he's there, and surely things are going to turn around at that moment, at that time. And um, days drug out. And about a week or so in, um, the Lord just impressed upon my heart to go. I was thinking I was just going for a visit that particular day and stay in touch and uh, Mm -hmm. check in. But wound up going every day. Mm -hmm. Yes. I just started. I just, it was just like clockwork. It was like during lunch. That's the time I need to go. I need to go and whatever, just be there presence-wise. Uh, support wise uh, uh, friend wise all of these things and pray and uh, while I was there and so after about a few weeks or no it was before that uh, pretty much immediately Prop B began to share with me since she had been there and her husband had been there and uh, just uh, of course she was there every day and um, the Lord began to, drop, began to drop into her spirit the library, some books from the Library of Heaven. Of course, me, I'm just always <laughs> just uh, amazed at how God does things. And so every day she began to tell me, uh, these are the books that the Lord told me about to write down today. And of course, I was I was so thrilled. I'm like, oh, what did he say? What did he say? <laughs> so that's... Uh, how I knew and how mm-hmm. this kind of came about the Lord while she was in the hospital, while her husband was in critical condition, and it wound up that the Lord, uh, make a, a long story short, uh, but it was so wonderful, um, the Lord worked a miracle. Yes. And he told Prophet B, the doctors, and I mean, I'm telling you, the doctors were saying everything negative, everything was negative. But the Lord told Prophet B, tell your husband, plan to live. So she stood on that word, and still God was giving these books from heaven. And uh, and they were just wonderful. So we began to share and talk about these books from heaven. And her stand, you know, well, when she told me what God said, I I, I was standing too. And uh, believing what God was going to do, and did. And so he meant that. And so today, her husband is well. He is Amen. alive and well, and yes. been home and moving about as if nothing ever happened. And so we're just grateful. Amen. Amen. And you know what? This is live on the air. So hand me my phone. I forgot to turn it. Um, it keeps pinging. On me. <laughs> and this is on air, very live. Bless God. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Amen. So I'm and, excited um, I am about too. these books from heaven. Yes, these yes. Library of heaven. And when each day before I would get ready to come over, I would um, be in prayer with the Lord and he would just take me up and take my spirit up Amen. into the heavens. And uh, I'd find myself walking down these unusual hallways and um just flowing with the Lord, just walking. And he would take me into the various rooms and uh, mm-hmm. show me all different kinds of books. And there was yes. a few books that he gave us. After my husband was home, he would continually give me a few books. But the, the majority of them, which are written down in this book here, mm-hmm. and he would give me, and some 
Some books, it was a line or two uh, uh, that he would give me to write about them, some more, some less, you know. But anyway, let's just start the sharing Amen. some of the books, praise God. Amen. And, mm -hmm. um, oh, praise God. Let's look at um, <laughs> mm, the book entitled Shadow of the Rainbow. Amen. Amen. Shadow of the Rainbow. And mm -hmm. God would give us certain things to write down. And when I would go up and share with Cindy, it's like the oh. power of God would just light up the room. And we were just so, yes. you know. And again, this broadcast is not for everybody, but it is for somebody, praise God, that mm -hmm. have seen something, that have been there, praise Jesus, uh, know something. Uh, but anyway, uh, Amen. you know, there's nothing like the presence of the Lord showing up, bless God, and Amen. lighting up your world. And he did for us, oh, bless yes. God. <laughs> yes. Amen. This is entitled Shadow of the Rainbow. And the Lord uh, spoke and said, what I have promised. I have promised. No natural man can turn these pages. For who can turn the rainbow? And he asked that question and posed that question to me. But then he said, only spirit can. Mm. Only spirit can turn this book, can handle this book. This was a real life, like breathing, living book. Jesus. And this book had a rainbow on the color of it, cover of it. And the pages reflected the rainbow. And the colors were in harmony, but different hues, tones, and measures, and chords. You know, it was alive. It's like almost making sounds in a sense. And then the Lord spoke these words. He said, Beloved, you'll see storms appear in life, but do not be moved. Peace, I speak unto you now. Mm. After the storms... Look for my rainbow in the sky. And then he says, There will be floods in life, but the waters shall not overwhelm you. Amen. Amen. Oh, thank you, Lord. Oh, Jesus. I thank shall you. not forget my promise. Amen. As you stand under the shadow of the rainbow, let it be that beacon of hope. And then he says, the rainbow is real, and so is my power for this hour. Yes. And you know, I, I've been seeing so many rainbows lately. I tell you, it's it's just been I awesome. Was, it's been awesome. I was awesome. looking for one when I came up tonight. Today. Mm -hmm. I tell After you, it rained. And you know where I've been seeing a lot of rainbows at? When I would, uh, my husband, he takes rehab exercise uh, each week. So many times a week, he's doing that, enjoying mm -hmm. it, and everything. But we go over there some morning, and there would be a rainbow right over the hospital, a rainbow. Oh, and I got pictures of them. I nice. said, oh, my God. I said, thank you, Lord. Nice. Amen. Now, this particular book we're going to read uh, is called The Book of Diamonds. Mm -hmm. The Book of Diamonds. And let me read because I write about my encounter and how, you know, we got there and everything. I was following the Lord in the library of heaven, and we veered off to the right into this the only thing I can call it was an elevator, but it was a high-tech, otherworldly elevator. <laughs> Praise God. Amen. And when we took off, it veered downward, and then it circled to the right. <laughs> Made a wide circle and continued to go downward. We were in what I believe was another part of the library of heaven. Mm. And I knew this part of the library was a different type of a section. I saw the Book of Diamonds and its letters on diamond pages. It was indescribable. <sighs> like the pages were made Ooh. of diamonds, but the letter on the pages were diamonds. Jeez. And it was indescribable, beautiful. It was living. It was alive. Mm. And I said, I wish I could read it. The Lord said, one day you'll be able to read it. But what I understood was the fact that my body, uh, whatever I was made of then, oh. could not handle that. But one day, those glorified bodies, Ooh. praise God, yes. will be able to read, will be able to handle some things, praise God. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Ooh. It was like glory in 
in a high sun ray. It was it was so beautiful, mm -hmm. and yet it was cool as a cucumber. Mm -hmm. You could feast off of the beauty of it. You could feast off of it. Mm -hmm. It's like God allowed you to have an encounter with it, but you were not able to bear the weight of opening it up and the weight of reading that book. Mm -hmm. The Lord said, people who stayed the course, whose lives were under intense heat and pressure, yeah. were in this book. Mm. Ooh. Ooh. I said, Lord, who would believe this? And he said, Cindy does. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> ah, glory oh, to God. And he was so right Woo. because Cindy, and thank Woo. God, mm. you, Cindy was not saying, I don't believe that. I don't Woo. believe Cindy was saying, you got to go pray. It. No, no. Uh -uh. She received. She mm -hmm. felt the presence of the Lord. Mm -hmm. She encouraged me, praise Jesus. Otherwise, I might not even, these pages Woo. would be empty because I might have gotten turned off. I might have mm -hmm. quenched the spirit Amen. of the Lord. I might have uh, just Jesus. many things, but thank God she was the right person there to believe, yes. praise God, in the supernatural power and ability of God to transport us, Jesus. to take our spirits Ooh, up, Jesus. to believe that that same apostle Paul said that he was caught up to heavens and he saw things and heard things that were not lawful to be seen, praise yes. God. Ooh. Oh, my God. Uh, John on the Isle of Patmos, caught Jesus. up to heaven. Jesus. Can you imagine what he mm. saw, praise mm. Jesus? This man was alive, and yet God gave him these encounters. Yes. Ooh, glory to God. Ooh, Thank God. you, Jesus. Thank you, God. Well, Thank you, I'm God. I just wanted to add up mm -hmm. or just share. Yes. That even just in that right there, oh, I just, you know, you just thank God for his people, for his gifts, his, his ministries, his offices that he imparts and endows mankind with to share with the body of Christ. Oh, because, I mean, it's it's encouraging because God don't deal with everybody the same. That's right. That's so right. in that, saying that, uh, it I mean, it increases faith. Mm -hmm. It increases yeah. a person's faith. It encourages them to let them know. I mean, do we dare to believe, Prophet? My God. Do we dare God. to believe in God in this hour? I know there's a lot of negativity going on, but mm -hmm. do we dare to believe God yes. in this yes. hour? Ooh, amen. God. Thank you, God. Amen. That is something. And uh, this is another yes. one. Praise Jesus. Thank you, God. Yes, mm. Jesus. Thank you, God. Mm -hmm. This is entitled Book of Tomorrow. Book of Tomorrow. Mm -hmm. This is what the Lord said. No natural man can read, for they cannot bear the weight of the sorrow. That's written in the book of tomorrow. Good God. Jesus. Only spirit Jesus. can read this book. And then he says, For shall the tomorrow of many be filled with sorrow? Hmm. Shall it be said, Almost thou persuadest me? Good God. Woo, Jesus. And then I went as I was putting it in this book and looked up the scripture for that. Yes. And that was Acts 26, 28. Then Agrippa said unto Paul, Almost thou persuadest mm -hmm. me to be mm -hmm. a Christian. Amen. Almost thou persuadest me to give my life to Jesus. 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 Almost. I'm not quite persuaded. Mm. Can you imagine the sorrow? My God. Jesus. Ooh. Ooh, Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Mm. Oh, God, God, God. My God, my God. And when you think about things like that, you know, somebody might say, well, why would God have that in the library of heaven or what have you? Mm. But when you think about it, he is the all-knowing, yes. omniscient God. He yes. knows yes. everything. We know he believes in writing things yes. down. He wrote the scriptures mm -hmm. down. Amen. And we're not saying... This by any means is uh, your Bible or this or that, yes. but uh, we do know that God is still speaking today. Praise Jesus, and uh, living. He's 
testifying, praise God, witnessing, bless God, amen, he shows up in the midst of your feast times, he shows up, bless God, Yes. and uh, this book is going to be so weighty because it's going to carry sorrow, and some of the sorrows will be men that were almost persuaded to become a Christian, oh God, almost persuaded to give their life to Jesus. But almost will never cut it. Mm-mm. Oh my God! What it, um, it made me think of. Um, I'm not sure if it's a scripture or not, or just how in the church world, you know, we say different things. Mm-hmm. Uh, but when the books are, uh, you know, it made me think as you're reading these, mm-hmm. you know, when the books are opened before the Lord, when the end, when it all comes down to the end and finality of some things, mm-hmm. when the books are opened. My God. Where will we be found, you Ooh. know, in these things? My goodness. Oh, and it's uh, serious, you know. Mm, um, mm, mm. Because God, you know, God is merciful. Even My these God. books, I mean, God, he said he'll do nothing. You know, he'll reveal nothing unless it's through his prophets, you praise know. Praise God, praise God. And yes, so yes. Uh, we know, you know, so mm. God in his mercy I look, yes. at, I look at this and see this as God's mercy, you know, to yes. let us know yes. his love and kindness and letting us know beforehand. Yes, amen. But go amen. ahead, prophet. Praise God. Oh, you just oh, said amen. that. Too. I was amen. just uh, looking, trying to see which one I want to dive in. And some yes. of these, sometimes I write Ooh. in Spanish, praise Jesus. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> Oh, my God. Oh, let yes, me see. Jesus. This, um, hmm. this is so good. Praise God. This is a book of transformation. Mm-hmm. Okay. And I want to look at my notes and says, I never told you to settle there. I have so much more for you. Unlimited glory. Inexhaustible, inexhaustible capacity. Mm-hmm. Above that which you think Hope, imagine, dream, comprehend, or perceive. Yes. And more belongs to you. Do you yet crawl when I made you to soar? Mm. Why do you remain earthbound Jesus. when you don't have to? Ooh, praise Jesus. Yes, yes. Have I not given you my word? Have you not known me? Have I been so long time with you and you refuse to see me? Do you crawl around with the weight of the world on your shoulders when I have given you the comforter? Mm. And I have down here John 14, 26. And I will pray the Father and he shall give you another comforter yes. that he may abide with you forever. And also... Romans 12, 2. And be not conformed to this world, but be ye transformed by the renewing of your mind that you may prove what is that good and acceptable and perfect will of God. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And when I think about this book, I think about how we have limited ourselves, Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. how we have settled in some places. And you think about that caterpillar, if he had settle crawling Mm -hmm. and that's a preacher right there that's a lesson right there you know if God put nothing else before us we can look at the life of that caterpillar just crawling but God is saying "Mm, I got more for yes I got more for you than that got more and not only that but potential on the inside the Mm -hmm. potential to rise Mm -hmm. The potential for more, praise yes. Jesus. And sometimes yes. we got to declare and decree a thing, be transformed to the place where we begin to call those things that be not as though they were. Where yes. we begin to say what God says about our situation, praise Jesus. Amen. So when we begin to uh, look at God when he called Abraham the father of many nations. Everything ruled him out, his age, his body, mm-hmm. or fertility, uh, ruled his wife out too. But God called him the father of many nations. 
limitations? What about if we begin to call mm -hmm. ourselves a different name? Mm -hmm. uh, what about if we begin to call ourselves and see ourselves in a new yes. place? Praise yes. Jesus. God said the potential is already on the inside of you to open your mouth and declare and decree a thing and I will establish mm -hmm. it. Why so few words? Why Jesus, so silent? Jesus, Jesus. And the book of transformation, well, one day we look in this book and see all that we could have been Ooh. and did, were not. All that we Jesus, could have accomplished Jesus, that was not Jesus. accomplished. All the power that we could have used and soared in the places and the things we could have yes. done for the glory of God, but we knew it not Jesus. because we did not Jesus. yield Jesus. so that God could feel Yep. And so, the book of transformation. Yes. Can you imagine one day in mm. heaven and you and I looking at these books mm -hmm. and saying, oh God, we could have did that. Yes. Oh, that was possible. Oh, that's what he had in mind. Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Oh. If I could only. Woo. Woo. Glory to God. It made me think as you were talking about, I immediately thought about Martha and Mary. You oh, know, my. how Jesus said, you know, mm. you know about Martha, just yes. you, you, you're doing too much. Mm -hmm. But mm -hmm. Mary desires that good part. Yes, yes. You know, desiring that good mm -hmm. part. Yes. I want to be changed. Mm -hmm. Do I? Where's our hunger and our yes. thirst? Yes. After, yes. as you were saying, mm -hmm. I want to be more. Do yes. I want to be more? Mm -hmm. Do I want to be just a caterpillar, or do I want to be that butterfly yes. that can soar, that mm -hmm. can fly, that just mm -hmm. carefree? Yes. You know, and the liberty, mm -hmm. you know. That's good, that's and good. To, and to just wherever the spirit, you know, leads and however the wind blows, mm -hmm. just go with it. Yes. And whatever he wants us to say, say it, mm -hmm. you know. And yes. uh, and let us just soar on the wings of love, as they say. On the wings. Oh, my God. Woo. Mm. Martha settled for negativity. That's right. She settled for worrying about the many of things of life. That's right. Instead of being hungry enough for transformation, mm -hmm. hungry enough, what's in that Bible? What does God say? You know, and he said, be ye transformed by the renewing of your mind. mind. Mary wanted her mind renewed. Sure Mary did. wanted to hear some good news. Mary wanted a change in life. Mm -hmm. Ah, my goodness. But Martha was busy Ooh. with the same old dialogue, the same mm -hmm. old thing. So one day when Martha be sitting up there because she was a woman that she loved Jesus. Yes. But would she be sitting at that table and pull out that book of transformation? Thank you, Jesus. And these are just my thoughts wondering. And would she look and see all that she could have been? Yep. But she was too busy. Didn't have time to study the word to show herself approved, a workman that needed not to be ashamed, rightly dividing the word of the Lord. Didn't Amen. have time to pray about it. Didn't have time to meditate on it. Yeah. So busy that yeah. she didn't have time to dream. Mm -hmm. uh, was not hungry enough or thirsty enough to see herself in a new place. Oh, but, whoo. Amen. Yes. Glory to God. We yeah. might want to take the time and sit a minute. Yes. Amen. Yes. Yes. My God. Thank you, Jesus. Praise God. Thank you, yes, God. Yes, yes, Oh, my. My, 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 my. Praise God. I wanted to um, find some of those with those examples. Um, mm -hmm. Examples of uh, the different things that God would have me to write. In, um, yes. Oh, my God. Such a. Amen. Mm -hmm. Amen. Thank you, God. Yes, God. Mm. Oh, my God. Jesus. Yes. Okay. And some, you know, a few things, but they were weighty what God yes. would say. The Amen. thoughts he would give us, the things that you can chew on. Uh, this is a book of timing. Mm -hmm. Book of timing. And we have Ecclesiastes 3 and 1. There's a season, a time appointed for everything, and a time for every delight, an event, a purpose under heaven. Yes. And then the Holy Spirit will give me certain things to write. What have you missed because you were at the right place at the wrong time? Oh, Jesus. What have you missed 
because you miss your opportunity with God. Yes. Because you would not be still oh, as the Holy Jesus. Spirit was leading you to be. Jesus. Did you drop the ball because you were not at the right place at the right time? Book of time. You know, and it brings you to a place when you think of this and just think one day if we were sitting mm -hmm. down and just even now today, oh, you know, if no. we said nothing else but the title of that, yes. we could feast and our lives could very well change because it lets us know that yeah. we don't want to be caught up in this book reading about ourselves one day and seeing Jesus. how we misuse our time. Mm -hmm. We don't want to see how... We didn't value the presence of the Holy Spirit enough to be sensitive to his movements, sen sensitive enough to his promptings. You know, yes. he says, uh, you need to get up like um, this. Uh, today, I was in prayer, you know, with the Lord. And again, he's been working. With, he said, get up and go in the kitchen, you know, and um, I got up and went in the kitchen and uh, he was prompted me, get a cup of tea and mm -hmm. sit down, you know. Mm -hmm. But what if I had been saying, well, Lord. I've not finished my prayer. Out. I have not put my list out. I have not, Amen. and which that was rolling in my yes. spirit. But you know what the Lord say? Done. <laughs> Done. Amen. Covered because see, He yes. knows me. You know. Yes. And it's like, yes. oh my God, Amen. it's like you have your laundry list. You see what I'm saying? A yes. people that you just must cover. But when God yes. shows up in the house, you know, Ooh, that's good. Glory that's to good. God. When that's God good. shows up, praise God. You can forget all that. He can cover it right Ooh, done. Yes. I yes, know everything oh, you're thinking good. about. I know everybody you want to pray for. That's done. Good. Now will you rise up oh, quickly and go good. into the other room? How do you know that danger was not abreast? How do you know that something was not going to happen, but you failed to obey Jesus, God because Jesus. you were stuck in a pattern? You were stuck in a holding zone. You were stuck with your own intellect. Praise Jesus. Mm -hmm. Oh, my. I mm -hmm. mean, look at tonight. You know, yes. I mean, we're sitting at the feet of Jesus tonight. Yes, yes, you know, yes, uh, yes. And that's believing. Yes. You know, these yes. are the words of the Lord, the Lord's impartation. So, yes. you know, I yes. take it serious and I believe everybody yes. else does. It's listening or you would move on. Yes. Probably, you know. But yes. this is a timing. Yes. You know, look yes. what we would miss. Mm-hmm. So we're sitting at his feet tonight. Yes, yes. You know, yes. not off somewhere doing whatever. Mm -hmm. Amen. Yes, my God. Ooh, glory to God. Glory mm -hmm. to God. Glory to God. Thank you, Jesus. Praise God. Oh, oh thank you, Jesus. and you think about God can use what God can use. He takes the foolish things to confine the wise. Amen. <laughs> We talked about somebody having a dinner party. You're inviting all this guests, 5,000 right. people. You only got two fish and five loaves. And you mean to tell me you're going to tell us to sit down <laughs> and feed them? And feed them? My God. That's the kind of thing that Jesus would um, do, bless God. We'd be looking for the mm -hmm. caterer. Amen. So is there a caterer coming? Yes, yes. And so it's almost like. You mean to tell me you're going to sit down with this book and you're going to expect to get fed? You're going to expect something to come up out of here? Amen. You're going to expect the presence of the Lord to show up? You're yes, going to expect something to be said to enrich your life mm -hmm. and my life? You mean to tell me that God's going to show up at this feast? Amen. Oh, yes, yes indeed. Yes, yes, yes. He's helping me right now. Praise me too, Jesus. Me too. Uh -huh. Oh, my God, you, my Jesus. God, you my God. You know where the presence of the Lord is? There's yes. liberty. Mm -hmm. There's freedom. There's deliverance. Yes, Whatever yes, you yes. need is in his presence. Yes. Amen. My God. I know I feel that. Who praise Jesus. Jesus. Praise Jesus. Jesus. Thank Re you, God. I mean, reviving. Mm -hmm. I mean, ooh, Jesus. Yes, yes, yes. My God. My God. Now this book, um, this book has uh, it's uh, has revelation on it, and it's the description of this book. It's a glass book and glass pages. Jesus, a glass book made out of glass and Ooh. glass pages. Jesus, and this is I got note. So we walk down the hallway through the clouds. Thank you, Jesus. America will see more storms. And this was recorded 10-5-22. Okay. Mm -hmm. America will see more storms. And I saw a pulse beat. 
Massachusetts. A miracle will resemble the wagon frontier. So you know how some of that frontier looked uh, mm. like a wilderness in mm -hmm. a sense. Mm -hmm. Many enjoyed beautiful homes and their dreams of retirement, beautiful beaches until suddenly. Jesus. So there's a suddenly coming. Many enjoyed these things, but change came on the scene. Mm -hmm. The storms would cause this place to look like a wasteland. Jesus. My God. And when we look around now, we see some of the results of that. Praise yes. Jesus. Goshen is not a geographical place, but you are Goshen. It's a Praise spiritual Jesus. dimension. Yes. You, my people, are equipped to be a blessing to the masses. Yes. We are the lights of the world. Praise God. When it gets dark, in other words, outside, we need some light. We need God's lights to shine. See, you'll shine with hope for your mm -hmm. next door neighbor. Yes, yes. You'll shine with some kindness. You'll shine with some patience. Mm -hmm. You'll shine with some goodness. Yes. You'll shine with some gentleness. You'll shine with some healing, praise God. God wants his lights to shine, praise God. Thank you, Lord. Goshen is not a geographical place, but you are a spiritual dimension of that. There's light, there are lights on in Goshen. Yes. You are that light. Yes. I'm that light. Yes. Giving out hope, laying hands on the sick and the sick recover. Yes. yes. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, God. My children, mm, mm, mm. my children have been living on entertainment. Mm. Not prepare for what's ahead. Get them ready. Give meat and bread. Yes. Looking, I could see the church in need of strength. Also leaders in need of strength. Jesus. And God yeah. continually keeps that verse before us. Yeah. Put, Put on, strength. on strength. It's time to change our garments from the weak garments and put on the Lord Jesus Christ. Yes. Put on the love of God. Put Jesus, on the word Jesus, of God. Jesus. Put on the peace of God. Put on the wisdom of God. Let us guard our hearts with all diligence for out of it flows the issues of life. Yes. Let us not entertain everything. We can't eat everything. We can't Amen. allow the gates of our uh, eyes, our nose, our ears, the sensitivity of touch. We can't allow Amen. the smell, the, these gates to be open, praise Jesus. We have yes. to put on strength. We have to guard the gate now. We have to watch and pray. The world is changing. You know, we yes. used to look at the soap yes. operas and they would talk about as the world turned and we'll talk about the days of my our life, you know, and we'll talk about general hospital, you know. Yeah. Back in those days, you can hear prophetically, it's like God using mm -hmm. some of those things to speak out to us, you Thank know. You, oh, glory to God. But oh, what God. is it that uh, is going forth now that perhaps we need to be paying a bit more attention to that's really uh, prophetically speaking to us Amen. and what's Amen. coming down that pipeline? Oh, Jesus. blessed be the name of the Lord. Jesus. Ooh, praise God. Revelation, praise Jesus. Oh, amen. Um, amen. Uh, 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 this book is going to be an interesting book, praise God. It's going to uh, yeah. be an in interesting book. You know, uh, things I wish I had viewed up close and personal and I had paid more attention yes. to. Uh, yeah. Revelation, how is it that I passed by uh, this program, you know, people used to have to want to watch these soap operas. They didn't want to miss these soap operas uh, mm -hmm. as the world turned, mm -hmm. days of our life. And there were many other soap operas, uh -huh. praise Jesus. But what if we had been more inquisitive into the things of the Lord? What mean of yes. this, you know? Amen. God, what mean of this? And why am I so on edge of my seat? I can't wait till Monday comes to see what happened. And they kept you spinning in a cycle. <laughs> Kept you yes. entertained, praise yes. Jesus. But Jesus. all the while, God was speaking, Talking. praise God. Jesus. Oh, my God. Thank you, God. Oh, my Jesus. Thank you, God. Jesus. Thank you, God. Jesus. Oh, my God. Oh, my, God. Oh, my Lord. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. 
Jesus, 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 mm -mm -mm. my God. All right, this is a good one. Mm -mm. Book of water. A book of water. This yes. is the name of this one. And these are the things I've written down. Swallow and drink. Mm. Believe and receive. No natural man can drink from this book unless they read and hear it. Yes. The two go together always. You got to read it and, and you got it. to hear it. That'll be the way you can drink. You got to read it. You got to hear it. Amen. Amen. Oh, thank you, Jesus. No natural man can read the book of water because they cannot handle the pages. Yeah. My goodness. Jesus. Pages made of water. water. How do you turn a page made of Jesus. water? Jesus. The natural man can't do it, but the spirit Spiritual man, man, one day, could it be that we will go to God's library? Could it be? Amen. That we would be able to turn pages. Jesus. That are made of water. That we'll be able to flip these pages. Mm. Oh my. Mm. Yes, God. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Here we go now. Here we go now. Um, mm -hmm. I drank from this book. It reminded me of a baby sucking milk. Yeah. But then God showed me the meat, and it was like lightning. Oh my God. Mm. I ate, and it went in my hands, and they lit up. Jesus. Like lightning. Jesus. <laughs> There were impartations of joy and electric joy from this book. Tasting a bit of this book tastes like meat. Mm. But the meat was such that my hands lit up like lightning. Jesus. What meaneth this? <laughs> but when I think about the power of the yes. word of the living God in this Bible, if we really could get a picture of what happens, praise Jesus, when we read and we meditate mm. on this word, yes. if we could get a picture of the power of that word, like when my husband went into the hospital, yes. he I was doing the dishes, he said, go tell your husband, plan to live, mm -hmm. us not knowing that he would be committed to the hospital and then there would be a journey yes. to follow. But those words were like lightning. I want you mm -hmm. to know they bore us up, praise God. Yes. Whenever I would think about it, whenever I would hear it, I heard God's breath in there. Yes. God's uh, strength came through there. Mm -hmm. It wasn't an empty word. It was full of life. It was yes. full of water. It was pregnant with promise. It had mm -hmm. answers to it. it. It had the capacity to hold me up mm -hmm. under Thank all you, kinds Jesus. of weather, praise God, and hold oh, my God. husband up and keep his body going and functioning, praise Jesus. Yes. Oh, glory to God. So if you Thank got a God. word from God, hold on to mm -hmm. it. Listen closely and don't forget to drink. Drink it, yes. praise God. Drink it. There's mm -hmm. power in that word, praise yes. God. Power yes. in that word. Mm -hmm. Oh, that word will wash you, bless God. Yes. It'll wash the unbelief right up under your feet, Boy, praise man. Jesus. That Ooh, word Jesus. was living. That word was Jesus. active. That word was sharp. That word, and thank God for the prayers of the saints, yes, praise God. Yes. Living prayers, breathing mm -hmm. prayers, you, prayers Jesus. that kept us, prayers that walk with us, faithful mm -hmm. people that prayed and prayed, praise Jesus. Oh, oh yeah. my God. Oh, it made me think of, uh, it's an uh, anchor, you know, the word yes. being an anchor, you yes. know. Yes, yes. I mean, um, I thought about Peter, you know, mm -hmm. that uh, he... The turbulent, he, he saw the turbulence, mm -hmm. and and of course, uh, he forgot about the word, the oceans, like the word, you know, I think about the ocean, it's the word, it's so, it's my moving, God, it's living, God. you know, and, and we anchor ourselves, Ooh, my God, you know, where my we God. can walk on water, my God, you know, we my can God. walk on the word, my God, and, uh, goodness, oh my goodness, goodness gracious, you know, it's, that, that mm. I mean, it's powerful, my God, you know, like the woman at the well of Samaria, you know, mm -hmm. and, uh, and the Lord said, if you drink of this water, you'll thirst again. Mm -hmm. But there's a water that God will give us. 
that we have no need to thirst again of Jesus because oh, the well is on the inside, amen, praise God. Amen. And we can go in and take a drink, praise Jesus. Yes. We can read the Ooh, word of the Lord yes. and take a drink. The spirit of the holy God is with us, bless mm -hmm. God, to quench mm -hmm. our thirst. When we say we want more and more mm -hmm. and more, mm -hmm. there's a fountain there that never runs dry, praise yes. God. Yes. That's a well that will never run dry, bless God. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Drink all you want. Drink all you want, mm -hmm. praise Jesus. Drink all you want. Mm -hmm. Bless God. And all oh, this next book mm -hmm. is the Book of Fire. Yes, oh, Jesus. The Book of Fire. This book, I'm standing looking at this book. The Book of Fire was on fire. Jesus. The pages were fire. And the words on the cover and pages were written in fire. And it was not consumed. It did not burn up. Jesus. My God, just to think of that right there. Now, these were the, who, I mean, my God. <laughs> Jesus. My God. Ooh. And on the third page, I did get to see this page turn. Mm -hmm. Now, you notice the natural person cannot turn these pages. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But on the third page yes. of this book, guess what was written on the third page? Consuming fire. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Consuming fire. Ooh, God. Yes. One of the names of God is consuming, consuming fire. fire. Amen. And note, I got a note here. Mm, mm. Thank you, Jesus. Ooh. Thank you, Jesus. I heard a voice say, which I believe to be the Holy Spirit, my fire shall be loosed. My fire, and I'm looking at this book uh, yes. a little later and um, on into 2023. I'm looking at this mm -hmm. book and I heard the Lord say during that time, this was after he had given me the books, that his fire was Jesus. going to be released. And can you imagine the fire mm. of God? And I think about even the glory of fire yes. of God. You know, yes. think about that fire that showed up on the day of Pentecost mm -hmm. that changed the lives of the people of God. Tongues of flame sit upon Amen. them, praise Amen. God. Don't you want the Holy Spirit oh, to yes, manifest Ooh, and Jesus. a dimension, praise God, that brought such life to the church. Yes. The church was on fire, yes. praise God. Oh, yes, ma'am. Oh, do it again, God. Ooh, do it again, God. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, hour. yes, 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 yes. And God kind of showed me a Ooh. vision. I saw men and women from different eras of time. And they were ministering. And they had tongues of fire coming out of their mouth. Jesus, Jesus. Tongues of fire coming out of their mouth. Men's from days of old, Amen. you know, men's, you know, we read about the Smith Wigglesworth and the yeah, yeah, Evan yeah, Robbins yeah, yeah. and the Dwight L. Moody's and mm -hmm. um, oh, just so many different ones back in, but as they were ministering, there was just fire. Amen. No Amen. natural man can read this book. Only the Thank spiritual you. man. Only spirit, my God. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, my, 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 my. Praise Ooh, Jesus, Jesus. Praise Jesus. 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 Yeah, it's going to be interesting interesting Ooh. to see how this book plays out. Praise Jesus. God. And see that glorious fire and moves of the Holy Spirit and all that he did. Bless God. And Thank you, God. Oh, my. Will we recognize the day of our visitation? Yes. Praise Jesus, my God. And these people, now notice, notice, notice. Mm. Jesus. These people were praying with one accord. Mm -hmm. No division. Yeah. But what if they had not been? Mm. They would have missed the day of visitation. We more than likely would not be here today. Praise Jesus. But thank God for people who pray at the right place at the, the right, right time. time. That'd be, that'd oh, be, my be God. Time and... Yes, yes. Amen. Oh, Amen. Jesus. God is going to be doing some interesting Jesus. things. Will you be there? Praise God. Amen. Will I be there? We want to be yes. sensitive to the Holy Spirit in this hour. And whatever he tells us to do, we, we want to do, do it. Praise God. Yes. We want to be found doing it. Yes. Praise God. Thank you, Jesus. Jesus. Hallelujah. Jesus. Oh, glory to God. Mm -mm -mm. Thank you, God. Yes. yes, yes. Perhaps I'll read one more, bless God. I've been so many through that. The pages. Oh, my God. Jesus, mm, Jesus. Mm, mm. Praise God. This is good. 
Book of Trust. Mm -hmm. The Book of Trust. This Book of Trust was made out of metal. And there were designs in the metal like squares. Some were line that, lines that were vertical in the square and the formation was unusual mm -hmm. design. Very unusual. It looks authoritative. The book of trust. Yes. Here we go. Trust is the simple things. Trust in the simple things. Uh -huh. Ask me and receive. Meaning if, um, Cindy, would you give me that book there? Would you hand me that book? This book here. Would you hand it to me? I'm asking God, and I am. Now, Cindy has it. It's there for me, but I got to receive it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I got to receive it. You ask God. He said, I want you to have it. Yes. But you got to receive it. Amen. So I got to handle it. I got to receive uh -huh, it. Uh -huh. Praise God. I take it from that unseen realm. Yes. Sometimes we take it with our declarations. Ooh. Praise God. Sometimes we take it, you know, declaring and decreeing a thing. Yes. Or we take it by faith. Praise God. But let's take it. Praise God. Sometimes we take it with thanksgiving. God, I thank you that by your stripes I'm healed, God. I thank you, Father, it is well in my home, God. Lord, I thank you for filling me with the Holy Spirit. I thank you, God. I feel new oh, strength rising you, up. God. I thank you, Father, for your help, God. I thank you for being, uh, oh, Lord God, the answers to every issue, Father. Ooh. Thank you for your touch, Jesus. God. Mm -hmm. Ooh, Go ahead. Just, oh, mm -hmm. Lord, you just, just in saying that, when you said, I got to handle it, mm -hmm. you know, I mean, it jumped off yes. on me Praise that Jesus. quick. Just Praise that word, Jesus. handle it. I got, mm -hmm. we got to handle mm -hmm. him. Mm -hmm. He said, my yes. hands have mm -hmm. handled. Mm -hmm. When we pick mm -hmm. up the word of God, mm -hmm. you're handling Jesus. Yes, yes, yes. You know, yes. you you handling mm -hmm. the Holy mm -hmm. Spirit. You're, right. I mean, mm -hmm. you're handling the sacred things of God. Mm -hmm. You know, right. the word of God. Mm -hmm. You're handling Thank you, you know, Jesus. Oh, I need your Ooh, healing. I'm telling you. Thank I mean, you just God. when you said mm -hmm. that, I got to yes. remember that. Yes. You know, mm -hmm. when uh, he offers us, you know, we come to him in prayer. We come to him asking. We have to take it and handle it. And knowing that it comes from him, all good and perfect gifts come from above. So whatever we need, whatever our needs are, whatever we're seeking the Lord for, for you know, coming to him and worshiping him in spirit and in truth. You know, we're handling all things God. Mm -hmm. You know, so yes. I know I'm finding myself mm -hmm. in this day. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And look at this. Yes. Now. God wants us to trust him. He said, ask and receive. Yes. Okay? So I asked Cindy for the book. She gave me the book. Yes. I handled it. Now notice this scenario in the Bible where mm -hmm. Thomas, who was unbelieving, they had told him the master had risen from the grave, but Thomas said, except I see him and put my hands in his side and mm -hmm. this and that, I won't believe. Yeah. Jesus shows up eventually and tells Thomas, he said, handle me and handle. see. Mm -hmm. Handle. Mm -hmm. Sometimes you need to put your hand on Jesus in faith. Yes. Grab that word in faith. Run with it in faith, praise Jesus. Uh, the others had, bless God, had an encounter. They shared it with Thomas. Amen. The master has risen. Amen. But Thomas said, I won't believe except I see it for myself. So now, there Jesus was right before him, you yeah. know. And then Jesus invites him on. Come on. You mm -hmm. said you need to handle. Yes. You said you need to put yeah, your hand in right. my side, you know. Mm -hmm. And that's when Thomas was persuaded. But let's handle by faith, praise by God. Faith. Let's receive that thing by faith, bless yes, God. Amen. Remember, I was sharing when I didn't have that refrigerator. I had an empty spot mm -hmm. prepared. I asked my husband, I said, move that old refrigerator out the way because God going to get us a new one. Yes. And I would go into the kitchen and I'd take the kids in there. There was this empty space. <laughs> oh, but I saw this refrigerator, brand new. Yes. I saw this up-to-date refrigerator. I said, oh, and then I began to handle it. Thank you, God, for this yes. refrigerator. Amen. Oh, thank you, God. Oh, and as Amen. I handled it, bless God. Oh, somebody ended up buying us a brand new one, paid every dime they mm -hmm. paid for it. We didn't pay for Amen. it. A gift, bless Amen. God. Look at Jesus. Let's handle these things, praise God. It's like you handled it with your eyes, mm -hmm. your spiritual eyes. I mean, yes. It was all mm -hmm. parts. All in. Was uh, we was eating. The gates yes. were open, praise Amen. God. We, uh, what you Amen. say? You're, 
You read it and you mm -hmm. hear it. You say, mm -hmm. I can hear it talking yes, back to yes. you. Yes, uh huh. Amen. amen, amen. And it said, Trust in the elaborate. Oh, yes. Ask me and receive. Ask me and receive. Exercise yourself. Mm -hmm. My God, exercise you. So, what would you ask God for now? And believing you receive it. Yes. Oh, bless God. Let's think of something. We don't have to share it. Let's think of something now. Let's ask him. You right there, ask him. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Yes. Thank you, Lord. Yes. Yes, God. Amen. Amen. Praise Jesus. Amen. Um, Amen. We might come back next time and say, what about that thing you asked God? <laughs> Did you get it? Did you receive it? Yes. And you receive it. You ought to be uh, shouting around the house, Lord, I just thank you for yes. this. I just thank you for that certain thing, whatever uh -huh. it was. Uh -huh. I just thank you. And then begin to put sight on it, put eyes on it, see what it looks like. What does that look like to you? Praise mm -hmm. you. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Amen. Pages in this book were too heavy for the natural man to turn the book of trust. Mm. Only spirit can turn these pages and read. Yes. When you hear it is well, read out of the book of trust. Don't add to the script and don't take away from the script. Yes. My God. Yes. Oh, so that refers me back to mm -hmm. the word of God mm -hmm. that when we read certain things in the Amen. word God said don't add and don't mm -hmm. take away in mm -hmm. other words uh, we're to trust in him with all our heart and lean not to our own understanding uh, and the Bible warns us about when we add right. or take away from the word of God and yes. uh, so God had made reference to um, when we um, you know yes. Uh, yes. read about the, from the book of trust and his Bible, bless God. That's a book of faith. That's a book that we mm -hmm. have to trust in. That's God's word. There's no book yes. like that word, praise God. That yes. is the word of the Lord. And God is admonishing us when we read from it, when we add. And then he has it in this particular book too, praise God. That yes. It is bearing witness with the fact that, um, bless God, we have to trust God, take him at his word, praise God. Thank you, God. Amen. When he says the effectual fervent prayers are the righteous of well of much, let's take him at his word. When he says man shall not live by bread alone, oh, but by every yes, word God. that proceedeth out of the mouth of God, let's take him at his word. I'm so glad that day when I was doing the dishes that God spoke yes. a proceeding word that he had not stopped speaking. And when he said, go and tell your husband, I said, plan to live. Yes. Oh my God. I'm so glad he's still Ooh, speaking Jesus. today. Praise Jesus. Yes. Hallelujah. Oh, good God. I feel Thank like shouting. God. Praise yes, Jesus. Amen. Oh, good God. Thank you, Jesus. Jesus. Mm, mm, mm. Uh, does not the book of Revelation warn to this? Oh, praise Jesus. Uh -huh. All right. Praise God. Okay. Trust in the Lord with all our heart. Lean not to our own understanding. In all yes. our ways, acknowledge him and he will direct a path. path. Yes. Don't add to the script. Yes. Don't add no worry to it, he says. Don't add no fears to it. Amen. Don't add no anxiety to it. Don't add. That's not in the script, praise God. He said, trust in him with all your heart and lean not to your own understanding, praise Jesus. Don't add, praise God. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Yes. Oh, my goodness. That's good. That's good. This has been wonderful. It makes that you just so want to uh, uh, keep Ooh. on. Praise God. Thank you, Jesus. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, my God. <laughs> Let me just read. I'm just yes. going to read this literally. Okay, we are going to prayerfully close with this. It's like this, this, God this is drawing me deeper to the web. Amen. This is entitled The Book of Well-Being. The Book of of well-being Jesus on the cover of this book there is a well and it is full of endless water now Jesus. this is not like a picture this is a reality this is the book mm -hmm. and on the book is a well in endless water oh, Jesus. Jesus Jesus no man can turn these pages they are too yeah. heavy the well is filled with an unlimited capacity and endless contentment, mm. endless serenity, yes. endless peace, endless rest, stillness, silence, yes. 
non-stop tranquility. Oh, Jesus, Jesus. Holy hush. <laughs> Blessed quietness. Overflowing. Fulfillment with no end. Yes. It's in the book of well-being. That's why it's so heavy. Yes. We cannot turn the pages. No natural man can. And that's Jesus. why it's so filled with water. Mm. It's endless mm. contentment. Remember Jesus at the well again, telling the lady, you drink of this water, you're going to thirst again. But the water that he gives us to drink, yes. within it is endless. <laughs> There's no end to it. Jesus. And the book of well-being, those who have tapped in. Mm -hmm. Have you ever tapped into the peace of God? But at some point, Jesus. you let go. Something separate us from that peace. What was it? Why were we not able to hang in there? God wants us to hang oh, in Jesus, there and Jesus. know that there's more peace. That it don't have to end. That he's given us an endless peace. Go back for more. He says, my peace I give unto you. My peace I leave with you. Let Jesus. not your heart be troubled, neither let it be afraid. Those, no doubt, who have drunk from this well, the well of well-being, the well of contentment. Perhaps you'll be there sitting at the table and say, I remember the day I drank of this, Mm -hmm. And I lost my appetite for confusion. I lost Jesus. my appetite for worry. I just wanted this peace. Oh, I just wanted this Ooh, contentment. God. I just wanted this rest. Jesus. I wanted his presence day and night. Jesus. I just wanted his touch. Jesus. I just wanted to hear his voice. I just wanted him to sing over me. I just wanted mm -hmm. to hear a sound. I wanted to experience Jesus, the rain Jesus. of heaven. I wanted to experience when he walked through the wall into my mm. dining room. Mm. Oh, ooh, ooh, glory. Oh, as you were talking. Mm. And uh, oh my Lord, you know, we, I jotted down, we run out because we see end. Mm -hmm. You know, we mm -hmm. run out. We yes. run mm -hmm. out of joy mm -hmm. because we, we, mm -hmm. we, we want to, we don't. We can't see past mm -hmm. That's good. end. That's good. That's good. We put a period on mm -hmm. it. That's when good. When Jesus, God is eternal. That's good. Jesus is eternal. Yes. We yes. don't look into eternal things. Yes. 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 You know. Oh, mm -hmm. Jesus. Yes, oh, yes. no wonder it's That's heavy. That's good. That's oh, good. If it, but with our Jesus. spirit, it becomes. He said, "My burdens are light." You know, follow me. You yes. know, it's light because mm -hmm. it's endless. Yes. Joy is endless. Yes. Patience is endless. Mm -hmm. Oh, I mean, anything you can imagine, all those things you, you listed, fulfillment, oh, yes, and all yes, of the quiet yes, is yes, endless. Yes, but yes. We, mm -hmm. we, we, we see too much mm -hmm. end yes, yes. when we should be looking mm -hmm. That's beyond. Right. That's right. That's right. That's right. Amen. Keep looking beyond. Yes. Don't lose Amen. your focus. Amen. Keep looking at that peace that Jesus said, my peace. Can you imagine his peace ever lending? Because we run out. Uh-huh. He's and a that, prince of oh, peace, yes, praise yes. God. Unlimited oh, yes. peace, bless Amen. God. So it don't have to end. We don't, the well, we don't well is never he runs don't dry. Run he don't run, don't out. run out. He don't dry up. Jesus. So God wants us to keep it. Oh. Don't let it go, daughter. Jesus. Hang on to that peace. Jesus. There's more where that came from. Yes. There's more. I didn't come to serve you a stingy oh, buffet, I, but oh, I came God. with more. How much is more? More is always more. Take that word. Write it down. Walk yes. around with it. More. More. You'll always have more if you have more. Praise God. He's a never-ending fountain, God praise Almighty. Jesus. A fountain of living water. He wants you to have Jesus. more. Unending, Jesus. meaning that Jesus. as soon as he said, we can put a period Ooh. behind certain things, but don't do that, don't bless do God. That. Keep on, bless God. Oh, thank you, thank Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Mm. Ooh, my God, God. my God. Ooh, Jesus, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Ooh, thank you, thank Jesus. Jesus. Thank you, thank you Jesus. Jesus. Thank you, thank you Jesus. God. Oh, my God. Ooh. And when you said that about My putting God. That, oh, thank you, God. Jesus. Thank you, Father. Yes, Jesus. When you said that about putting that 
period behind it, how we can put a period behind yes. things. I was reminded, the Holy Spirit reminded me, and I was thinking about it actually earlier, when this gentleman was in the hospital and he was trying to get us to do something like a hospice thing, they want to go home with my husband, they wanted to, uh, and I kept, uh, no, we, no, no, but he kept trying to persuade me that, that to come on, and what? Cindy was sitting right there with me. Finally, Cindy said, Put a period right there. Don't go Just no don't go no further. Just put a period there. <laughs> that, that is not the answer. <laughs> that is not the answer. Praise Amen. God. But in our case, the Lord wants us to erase that period. Yes. Uh, even and get that, that yes, comma us. out the way. Uh huh. Ooh. And let's drink because the yes. fountain never runs out. Yes. Can you yes. imagine our daddy, our heavenly father, yes. having an empty refrigerator? Ooh, Jesus. Can you imagine? Jesus. Miracles Jesus. don't end. Praise mm -hmm. God. Mm -hmm. Healings mm -hmm. do not mm -hmm. end. Praise mm -hmm. God. Mm -hmm. Can you imagine? He's got more, so much Jesus. more. The Jesus. enemy wants us to think it's limited. The yes. enemy wants us to think that he's going to run out. No, he has so much more. Mm -hmm. And you think about the script that said, if the yeah. uh, books were written Jesus. of the things that Jesus did, the world could not hold them, praise God. Thank you, God. The world could not oh, hold Jesus, them. Jesus, oh, my, 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 Jesus, my. Jesus. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Yes. Praise God. Thank you, God. Holy Ooh, Spirit, we yes, thank God. you for allowing us, Lord thank God, you. to share from the books that you've given us oh father god and lord may you ever be glorified may you forever be magnified may you seal this video god for the eyes that you would have to uh listen and partake god and lord may you touch them lord god with your understanding and revelation lord god that they will have the capacity lord god to receive, Lord God, uh, this session of what we were doing in Veronica's wing. God, you named the broadcast Veronica's wing. And Father God, we get a sense that you're going to bless us to share a lot of unusual things, Father, that many may not be ready to receive, thank God. You. But we thank you, God, for this opportunity, Father God, to sit Oh, God, among the great, Father, mm -hmm. to sit, Father, in your awesome presence, Lord God, to feast, Father God, on your word, on your hidden manner, Father. And we thank you and thank we you, praise Jesus. you, Father God, and to you, God, be all the glory. Yes. And to you, Father, be all the praise, oh, Father, Jesus. in Jesus' Jesus. mighty name. And thank you so much. Thank Bless you. all of our viewers, Father. Thank you, Jesus. Bless them, Lord God, to be able to chew, to be able to swallow, Father. Thank you, God. Let nobody get choked up, God. Thank Nobody, you, oh, Father. Thank we pray, oh, Father God, only the eyes and the ears that yes, you anoint to hear, God. Those that are hungry, oh, Father God. Oh, Lord God, so we thank you, Father, and we praise you, Father God. Our times are in your hands, oh, God. Oh, Father God, in Jesus' name. And thank you, God, for remembering those, Lord God, that may be what my husband was, Lord God, in a battle, in a fight, oh, Father God. But, oh, God, we thank you that you are ever-flowing fountain. You just don't run out. Healing just keep flowing from you, Father. Healing and signs and wonders and Jesus, miracles. Uh, they are still Jesus, pouring Jesus. out like rivers. They are still Jesus. pouring out like great drops of rain. The love of God is still raining. Jesus. He's bountiful in these miracles. He wants us to have them. He wants us to be healed, praise God. Thank you, Lord God, for sending your word to heal us and deliver us from Thank all destruction, Jesus. Father. We give you all the glory, Thank Father, you. and all the praise. In yes, Jesus', Jesus. mighty name, Jesus. amen, 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 amen. Thank amen. you, God. Amen.